Hey everyone, this is Mr. and today I'm going to show you how to beat Keratus Maximus here on the test realms. I've been trying with quite a few um, aquatic uh, animals or pets, uh, but so far I've had the most success with the toads and the frogs. So uh, this is what I'm going with now. I have beaten uh, Keratus Maximus one on level 23 and on level 24, but um, just keep in mind that uh, I haven't tested this on level 23, uh, 5 because I haven't gotten any 25 yet. So it might be that it's uh, it's not this tactic is not working for for level 25. But anyway, I'm running with cleansing rain on this uh, first frog or toad, and then frog kiss and water jet. And just start out by doing cleansing rain because it will uh, make aquatic abilities deal 25% extra damage and uh, that's really helpful when you're fighting characters. So on the second two frogs or toads I'm going with the healing a healing wave and the reason for this is that um, well <laughs> it's always good to keep them alive for as long as possible so I'm just firing it off now uh, to heal to almost full health and then just going frog kiss, frog kiss, frog kiss, frog kiss and you saw before uh, when he turned into a frog I went with the water jet and that's of course because when they uh, uh, turn into a frog you can see here polymorphed it's uh, well it's unable to use attacks so it's good to get some extra damage in this you could also go with frog kiss again but uh, well I just like to get some extra damage in so again um, it's 25% uh, chance to turn into a frog and you want it to <laughs> happen as often as possible because that will make the fight a lot easier. You also want to fire off healing wave um, as often as possible because uh, you, <laughs> well, you need to, to keep these guys alive uh, so they can actually deal the damage. So you can just see here I'm, I'm hammering away at his health, uh, he's using his um, his seed to heal up, which of course is not really ideal for me, but um, at the same time he's also using cleansed to, to clear off his uh, buff, which is uh, ideal for me, uh, because it makes me do more damage. So I'm here on my third frog. When he's level 23, sometimes if you're lucky with the, um, um, with the kisses, if you're lucky with his uh, cleansings, etc, etc, you can actually do this with just two frogs, but uh, in this case, I'm I'm having to go with my third frog as well, but it should, it should be fine still. So I'm just hammering away at his health. He turns into a frog, and this is perfect. He did it while he has no buff on him, so I'll do a lot of damage with my uh, water jet. Uh, and there you go, he's done. So wh when he's level 23, it's really really easy to beat him with the three frog tactics. When he's 24, it's the requires a little bit of luck with the kisses and uh, it requires you to get the heals off at the right uh, uh, right um, times. When he's level 25, as I said, I haven't tested it, but uh, I'm sure it's possible, just uh, maybe not a surefire tactic. So if you guys have a tactic that works on level 25 as well, 100% of the time, just throw it in the comment section below. And, and the same for if you have any ideas. Uh, thoughts, um, feedback, or anything like that that you would like to share, um, just uh, just put it down there in the comment section. I like getting feedback from you guys. And uh, that's about it. Make sure you subscribe. And until next time, bye bye.